Hello everyone, this is our 2018 Mercedes-Benz C63S AMG with 33,659 miles. Beautiful silver color, really nice condition. Does have some metallic flake in there. Looks really, really good. Front end is in good shape. It does have a few minor blemishes across the front, next to the headlight there. A few little odds and ends. Nothing major or, uh, you know, glaringly obvious. Just a little bit of wear across the front. A few rock chips, but nothing serious. All these defects are very small and negligible. I am just pointing it out for the sake of full disclosure and honesty. Not trying to hide anything here. So overall, the front end looks pretty decent. A little bit of wear for driver's side fender. Again, has a few small marks in it right here. They don't really stand out very much. For driver's side wheel. Driver's side mirror. Looks great, very nice gloss black. All the trim is gloss black as well, like the uh, window trim, etc. Driver door. Looks good, does have just a few small marks there, there, and down there. But overall looks really nice. Driver's side rear quarter panel. No issues there, looks great. Rear driver's side wheel. Excellent shape, no flaws. Moving around to the back. Quad exit, AMG exhaust tips. Does have the sport exhaust as well. One small mark here on the bumper. There, and I believe there as well. Uh, but that is very zoomed in. Not super easily uh, seen. I don't think it stands out and really gets your attention. I only know it's there because we've gone over every inch of the car prior. Face of the trunk and the top of the trunk lid. Looks awesome. No marks, no defects. Back bumper looks good too, it just has those two very minor spots. Passenger side, rear quarter panel looks great. You can really see the personality of the paint with the sun shining across it. Beautiful silver. Rear passenger wheel looks really nice. Passenger door it does have just a couple rock chips there. Passenger mirror, looks good. Front passenger fender. And the passenger front wheel, looks great as well. I'll go ahead and walk around the vehicle from a one foot distance to give you a better big picture idea of the overall condition of the vehicle. Here at Exotic Motorsports, we like to do these comprehensive walk around videos to give our out of state buyers the confidence and peace of mind they need to purchase a vehicle from a site unseen if they choose to do so. Walking around a vehicle from a one foot distance is a lot more indicative of what you might notice on a day to day basis and helps to separate the larger, more obvious flaws from these smaller, less significant ones, helping to give you a more accurate representation of the overall condition of the vehicle. Hopefully, I've done that and you can see how nice this C63 is. Really gorgeous car. Uh, the driving experience is on par with the aesthetics. This is an amazing machine. I'm a little partial to Mercedes myself, but this car objectively, I think, is just a ton of fun. Uh, here in the interior, we do have very nice black leather, kind of brushed aluminum looking accents, some white Alcantara in there as well. A little bit of wear on the armrest, just a little bit. Nothing serious. The driver's seat looks good. So we do have one touch windows for the driver and passenger side, heated blind spot assist, auto dimming, power folding side view mirrors, heated and cooled perforated leather memory seats, power adjustable of course, Burmester premium audio, 360 cameras, toilet sensing headlights, Alcantara accents on the steering wheel, and the seats are the uh, they're automatic when you fold them forward, they slide forward uh, to help your passenger get in the back there because this is a coupe. 
Back seats look fantastic, no issues. Cup holders in the middle, it's pretty cool. And then when you recline it, it will slide back into position. Pretty awesome. Push button start. Fires right up. We're at 33,659 miles, right there on the dash. Navigation, Bluetooth, satellite radio, carbon fiber center console here. Different driving modes, manual mode, suspension adjustment, traction control. Then we've got the infotainment volume, sport exhaust option, auto start stop, and the seatbelt extension button. Climate control here in the center does have dual zone automatic climate control. Paddle shifters for the automatic transmission. Uh, it shifts super quick. It feels like a DCT, honestly. Uh, it doesn't really feel like a standard auto. It's very responsive. In my opinion, that's definitely a good thing. Dash looks really nice. Auto dimming rear view mirror with universal garage door remotes. This is what I would consider to be a panoramic sunroof, especially with it being a coupe. Uh, you can only have the roof line, you know, go back so far for it being glass. Uh, definitely bigger than a standard sunroof, in my opinion. I love Mercedes has the seat controls here on the side, makes it very ergonomic. Uh, the interior is just very comfortable. It feels very suited to the driver. Um, the way you see the gauge cluster and the way you are positioned in the seat, uh, I feel like is incredibly pleasant. Mercedes did a good job with that, keeping the driver in mind. Now we're going to talk about one of my favorite parts about this car and many other Mercedes is the drivetrain. We have the 4 liter twin turbo V8 engine, makes tons of power. Uh, it's really nice because in comfort mode, it'll shift low and it produces a lot of torque. Uh, early enough in the power band to where it shifts really smooth it doesn't have to rev up or make you know a bunch of racket trying to get up to speed um it gives you a really smooth pleasant seamless driving experience but in sport uh it'll rev up and it'll give you boost and this thing will take off like a rocket this car is not slow it's super fun to drive especially when you put it in uh manual mode as well and shift it yourself it makes it even that much more fun this is a great super reliable powertrain uh, that Mercedes is putting countless vehicles idling away as smooth as can be. This is a great car. Looks really nice and the driving experience definitely matches the looks. Um, tame, pleasant, kind of understated in comfort mode when you want it to be. But open the valves, stiffen the suspension, put it in sport and you have yourself a daily drivable track car. So that is our 2018 Mercedes-Benz C63S AMG. If you have any further questions, please feel free to check out this vehicle on our website at exoticmotorsportsok.com. Thank you for watching.